Number five, what is the direction of the magnetic field that produces the magnetic force on a positive charge as shown in each of the three cases in the figure below, assuming B is perpendicular to the velocity? So please, please check out number one. Um, I went through a long analysis there um, with a picture and all. All right, you got to understand that one before you even approach this. Um, and check out number two as well. Just It's a negative charge. This one's for positive, but... Um, it's just extra practice. Check out, check them all out. I mean, the, that would be the best, but at a minimum one. Okay, I'm going to assume that you have watched that, and uh, we're going to continue from there. So now, uh, applying now right-hand rule number one, and since we're dealing with a positive charge, we know the force is coming out of the palm. So now what I need to do is I need to uh, direct my finger, okay, my, th excuse me, my thumb. Well, it is a finger, but the thumb. All right, direct a thumb directly upwards, Okay. Remember, you got to lock your hand first in a, in a rigid shake position, so to speak. All right, so the thumb is pointing up. Now, the force here, the force here should be pointing directly to the left. So actually, with your thumb pointing up and your palm pointing directly to the left, it looks like you are shaking someone's hand at the moment. Okay, it should look exactly like that. If it looks like that, then your four fingers are pointing directly into the computer screen. Right? So if that's the case, then you then you have performed this correctly. So the finger should be into the screen. So this is then the direction of the magnetic field. I would write into screen or into page or away from you. It doesn't matter. Okay? Now for letter B, lock your hand in that rigid shake position. You got to first point your thumb downwards. Okay? Make sure your thumb is down. Now the palm here must be pointing into the page okay so with your thumb pointing down your palm then must be into the page okay or into the screen now your palm should be facing the computer screen if your hand is still locked in that rigid shake position where your thumb is 90 degrees to the four fingers then your four fingers should be pointing now to the left okay so that is now my friends pointing to the left that is the direction of the magnetic field left. Now letter C, take again, start within that rigid position, take your thumb and point it now to the left. Okay. First take the thumb and point it to the left. When I naturally do that, my palm goes down. Now I don't, that might not be the final direction, but that's what happens when I do it. My, when I point my left, my thumb to the left, I just naturally just go into a palm down position. Okay. Almost like I'm asking someone to kiss the back of my hand. Now, the force, though, which since this is a positive charge, is not pointing down in this problem. It is pointing up. So what you have to now do, keeping your thumb pointing to the left, you have to somehow now take your the palm of your hand and point it upwards. Your thumb must stay, though, pointing to the left. Okay? So it's kind of like I rotate my wrist a little bit, and it's almost looking like I'm a waiter now. Right? Uh, holding a tray of food, a platter of food, right? That's kind of what it looks like. So if that's the case, your thumb should be pointing to the left, the palm is pointing up, and then what we have is we're going to have the four fingers now pointing out of the computer screen, okay? So there'll be little dots, little dots all around. So the magnetic field here, B, is pointing out of page screen, whatever, towards you. It doesn't matter what you what you call it. All right. So that's that, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate it. Please remember to check out those other problems and I'll see you in the next question. Take care.